are flying at the State House over a bill to legalize the sale of fireworks in Iowa. A North Carolina family is in Des Moines right now. They're trying to lobby lawmakers against that proposed legislation. KCCI Cynthia Fodor is live in downtown Des Moines to explain. All right, Stacy and Steve, with Fourth of July just around the corner, sparklers like this. They're burning out here. And these snakes, you remember these, Steve, they are showing up in stores right now. But these are about the only fireworks you can buy legally in Iowa right now. Right next to the patriotic flag set out for the 4th, you'll find these. But a bill approved by the House would add more than a dozen consumer-grade fireworks to the legal list. These are explosives. We don't call them explosives. We call them fireworks. Jack Shannon calls them deadly. He lost his three-year-old son, Michael, when a faulty firework sped toward his head. He was standing between my legs. There was nothing that I could do. To help him. Shannon and his daughter are meeting with lawmakers one on one to tell their story. Oh, and I just wish that this would never happen to somebody else, that they would have to live through the horror that my family did. The Consumer Product Safety Commission reports 40% of injuries occur in children under 14, and 33% of shipments tested, most from China, were non compliant, which is why Senator Matt McCoy doesn't want them here. And to put these fireworks out there and make them legal and, and available to the public. Like knowing, knowing what we're going to run into in the way of injuries, to me, just smacks of being irresponsible. State Representative Jack Highfield grew up in Nebraska where fireworks are legal and voted for the new law. Things are safer when they're not always against the law. When we, we believe legalizing and having the safe approach and having the proper education is the way to go instead of always having people drive to Missouri and they're getting them anyways. Well, you are supposed to keep a bucket of water handy to put out your sparklers, but will this whole debate fizzle? The Senate is supposed to take up the bill when lawmakers return to the State House June 1st. Live in downtown, Cynthia Fodor, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.